Hello everyone, this presentation is done by Professor Sudish Fatangari from Dr. D.Y. Patil Institute of Hotel Management and Catering Technology, Pune. In today's session we will discuss about various cooking methods. In this slide we will learn about the principles of heat transfer. Transmission of heat occurs by Conduction Convection Radiation in this slide we will discuss about conduction. Conduction is the movement of heat from one item to another provided they are in direct contact. In this slide we will discuss about the convention. Convention is the transfer of heat through a medium either, liquid or gas. There are two types of convection. Natural. Mechanical. In this slide we will discuss about radiation. Radiation method does not require physical contact between the heat source and the food, instead the heat energy is transferred by waves of heat or light which strike the food. There are two types of radiation heat transfer, namely, infrared, microwave. In this slide we will discuss about various methods of cooking. Basically there are two methods of cooking. Dry heat methods. Moist heat methods. In this slide we will discuss about moist methods of cooking. The first method is boiling. This is cooking the food completely covered with water, heated up to boiling point, which is 100 degrees Celsius. Next cooking method is stewing. This is cooking food in a small measured amount of liquid that is allowed to simmer. It is a long slow method of cooking tough hard foods for example beef, poultry, vegetables. Now we will discuss about steaming. This is cooking of food using steam for steam from boiling water. The steam does not come into direct contact with the food, it comes into contact with the container holding the food. Now we will discuss about next cooking method which is poaching. This is a moist method of cooking in which food is placed in liquid which is brought to and maintained at a temperature just under boiling point which is 100 degrees Celsius. In this slide we will learn about frying. Frying is cooking food in hot fat or oil in a pan. There are two methods of frying. Shallow fat frying. Foods to be shallow fried are cooked in a small amount of fat or oil. The level of fat can be anywhere from halfway up the side of a food. Deep fat frying. It involves the complete immersion of food in hot fat or oil. In this slide we will discuss about dry methods of cooking. The first method is baking. In this method of cooking hot dry air is used. It is usually done in an oven. The next dry cooking method is roasting. It is a process of cooking food over a fire such as glowing charcoal. Another way of roasting is cooking food in a heated oven or while it is rotating on a spit. In both cases fat is used to boost the food. It is a suitable method for cooking meat. Now we will discuss about grilling. Foods cooked by grilling are placed over or under the direct heat source and re-cooked by radiation. If the food is fairly thick, then only the surface is cooked by radiation and further cooking takes place by condition. In this slide we will discuss about microwave cooking. Food cooked by convectional methods use heat transfer by convection, conduction, and radiation. But microwave ovens operate by a different mechanism. Thank you.